Okay, so challenge projects can come in all shapes and f forms. Um, they could be challenged from the outset in terms of politically challenged. Um, even though a project is strategically aligned, um, the politics in an organisation might cause it to be challenged from the outset. Um, you might have some stakeholders which are really positive enforcers of the project and want the project to be delivered. You might have other people who, for political reasons in the organisation, really don't want that project to take place. Um, so a, challenges in, a challenge project can actually start from you know, prior to initiation, um, when you're doing your, your first stakeholder engagements. Um, challenge during initiation and scoping of a project um, could be different. Um, you could be running to different challenges to do with um, financial challenges, um, you know, time challenges, demands in terms of scope challenges. Um, as you move through into planning, um, again, it could be around degree of um, depth in the planning. Um, you know, I've been involved in projects where you haven't been allowed the luxury to go to the level of depth in planning um, that you would ideally like to. So again, you're challenged at that point of time. During execution, it could be your stakeholders, it could be your customers who are receiving the project, could be challenging it. Um, and during closure, um, again, it could be back to those stakeholders who you're handing over to, unless you've got the audit trail of deliverables. Um, right down into to closure, um, you could be being challenged on what was actually delivered, when, to what quality criteria.